Hi everyone and welcome to another video from DisparyPair.com. In this video we'll show you what are some of the most common reasons for low oil pressure. Low oil pressure can cause major engine damage so this is very useful to know. Stay tuned. DisparyPair.com be sure to visit us at our website despairrepair.com where you can find more useful car and driving tips. Worn out oil. One of the most simple yet very common reasons for low oil pressure is worn out oil or one that hasn't been changed on time. Worn out oil loses its viscosity and main characteristics over time which severely impacts gaining and maintaining proper oil pressure in the engine. Clogged oil filter. The next simple reason is a clogged oil filter. If it's clogged, it causes a jam in the oil circulation system and thus low oil pressure. If the oil hasn't been changed on time, then this should definitely be checked. Oil quality and characteristics. If the engine oil is of low quality or even worse, it has the wrong characteristics, it can also seriously affect the oil pressure. Low quality oil loses viscosity fast and you soon get the effect of worn out oil, although you've changed it. With the wrong characteristics it's even worse as it not only affects oil pressure but can even damage the engine. Oil leaks. Oil leaks will seriously affect oil pressure only if there is a big leak. In this case you should notice this reason easily as there will probably be oil under the car at the same time. Look for things like cracked oil sumps, loose screws or bolts or other bigger problems. A faulty oil sensor. Another fairly common problem, especially with today's modern electronic systems, is a faulty oil sensor. These sensors suffer mostly from material fatigue over time and when they get faulty they show false readings. In this case the engine and all the systems are okay, although the warning light is always or intermittently on. A bad oil pump. The oil pump is in charge of pushing oil through the whole engine. Oil pumps in most cars last very long, sometimes as long as the engine, especially if the oil is changed on time. This is not the case with every engine, some have faulty oil pumps and systems to begin with, but usually, on average, the oil pump is a rare problem. When it is the problem, there is a weak oil circulation in the engine and this causes weak oil pressure. Engine problems. For the last and most serious reason on this list and that is engine problems. Most engine problems regarding low oil pressure are serious and costly to repair. Some of the most common are worn out piston rings, worn out crankshaft bearings, damaged cylinder walls and else. In most cases this is caused by poor maintenance, mainly disregarding the oil change interval, sometimes it's caused by overheating and else, but is also often present in high mileage cars which have done their time. In this case the only solution is a partial or complete engine rebuild. One more reason worth checking, although this is rare, is a missing oil cap. I've seen more than once that people forget to return the cap when topping off oil for instance. For the end, a key preventive measure for avoiding a low oil pressure problem is changing the oil on time and doing proper maintenance. When you do this, you may avoid this problem altogether. But if it, God forbid, happens, you must react immediately and inspect the problem otherwise the engine may suffer heavy damage. So that's it for this time, we hope the video helps, please like and subscribe, it's a huge help for what we're doing. Thanks for watching and thanks for your time.